probably just the usual Todd Manning hatchet job. I don't know. I mean, it seems possible. Something happened to mess up your plea bargain. You were supposed to get out free. Well, I guess Fitzwater wanted to make an example of me. Yeah, but the deal was done. Why? I mean, why would she change her mind all of a sudden? Yeah, it is kind of weird. I mean, it says in here that then Jen made it seem like that you would kill Mitch if, if uh, she let you out free with no jail time. Yeah, but that's crazy. Why would Jen do that? Well, I don't know. Why does Jen do anything that she does? You broke her heart. Yeah, but, I mean, Jen was there. She saw the fight, and I didn't say any of that stuff. She knows that. I don't know. But, I mean, this story seems to explain it, and nothing else does. Maybe my Uncle Todd was right for once. Maybe Mitch did put her up to it. With Mitch in my loft, but, but she was scared of him. Yeah, well, she wouldn't want you to know they were friends. You could have caught them planning. No, Jen's not that good a liar. But why? Why would she do that? To keep us apart? No, no, she knows it's way too late for that. I don't know, maybe she was just mad about the breakup. Mad enough to send me to jail? I sure hope you're wrong, Natalie. Yeah, well, I do too, for Jen's sake. I don't know, it just doesn't seem like Jen. And working with Mitch really doesn't seem like Jen. Are you sure? Sure. You okay? I'm fine. Sure about that? Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. How about you? Darling, I heard about Christian's sentence. I'm so sorry. Yeah, me too. I just came back from the jail seeing him and I just, I can't believe he's in jail. I can't believe he's going to be there for 30 days. You know, I don't quite understand why Judge Fitzwater rejected the plea bargain agreement. She's generally very fair. Yeah, well, I think I understand. You do? It's really terrible. Yeah. Has Sam seen this? I don't know. I mean, I know that Jen has had some trouble recently, but if this is in fact true, well, I'd be willing to bet that Mitch took advantage of her. That man is so despicable. Mm-hmm. But of course, that's what he does best. He takes advantage of very vulnerable young women, and then he hurts them. Yeah, well, I just led him to a nice, fresh crop of them. I mean, if it hadn't been for me, then he never would have gotten to Jessica. No, honey, don't believe that. He would have found another way. Did Jessica leave already? Yeah. Yeah, I just said goodbye to her. You already miss her, huh? Oh, yeah, very much. Me too. I mean, I want her to go off and do what she needs to do, you know, make peace and make herself happy. That's really all you want when you have children. You want to make them happy. Yeah, but it's still hard when they leave. Yeah. That's strange. That's what I've been sitting here thinking about. My family. How many of them have gone? My mother died when I was very young. My father... Well, he's dead. My sister, Meredith, and then my brother, Tony. You know... I really wish I'd had the chance to get to know all of them. I wish you had to. Especially Megan, my daughter. You would have loved Megan because you two would have had so much in common. Yeah, well, we both made your life miserable. No. You both filled my life with love. You have the same sparkle in your eyes that Megan had. You are so full of life, Natalie. And she was, too. It must have been really hard on you. I mean, she died at such a young age. 
Yeah, it was very unfair. You know, I had just found her, and then she was taken away from me. And Ben, I just can't bear the thought that I might have to say goodbye to him, too. Seems like you've had to say goodbye to a lot of people. Yeah, it does seem that way, doesn't it? <laughs> And then my sister Tina, she's off doing something, God knows where, I don't know. Todd drops in and out of my life whenever he feels like it. My boys, my grown-up sons, Kevin and Joey, they're so far away. And now Jesse is too. Thank God I have you. You're all I have left, I thank God for that. I love you so much. I want you to know that I'm not going anywhere. I love you, too. You know that. And I don't want you to ever think that you have to try and replace somebody. The wonderful thing about you is that you, you are who you are. And you are my daughter. I also don't ever want you to think you have to stay here just to be with me. You have a life, sweetheart. And you're going to want to follow your dreams and go and do whatever calls to you. I know. I, I do. And I, I wish I could say it was totally selfless that uh, I want to stay. But it's also for me. Um, I really need my mom. Oh. Okay, both of us. Hmm. I really want to believe that. Well, then you do. I, I want to. I do. I'm just, I'm so worried about Christian right now. I love him so much. Listen to me. You and Christian are going to be just fine, honestly. If there's one truth I have learned after living in this house all these years. Love does always find a way. You really believe that? Love is the strongest force in this universe. It is stronger than jealousy or hatred. It can be stronger than death. And it is sure as hell stronger than Mitch Lawrence. Miss Davidson? Yes, officer. Just checking in. Is there anything you need, ma'am? Uh, yes, actually. Would you mind taking my daughter over to the jail, please? There's somebody she wants to visit there. No, you don't have to do that, Mom. I'm not going to do it. You're going to see Chris. <laughs> okay, but I don't want to leave you here alone. Oh, come on. I'm fine. I am. All right. Thanks. I'll see you later. Okay. Bye. Hey. Hey, Yeah, it was my mom's idea. Not that I would have stayed away anyway. Yeah, I hate that you have to come down here. It's not so bad. You're here. So what, what did Jen have to say? She said she didn't do it. All of it? Yeah. Yeah, she said she never said those things in front of Fitzwater and that she, well, that there was no way she was involved with Mitch Lawrence. Do you believe her? I don't know. I'm not sure what to believe. I have to find out if Jen did this. I mean, if, if she's really working with Mitch... Look, Natalie, why don't we just forget about it, okay? Just let it go already. I, 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 can't, I can't forget about this. I mean, Christian, I told you what Mitch said. He said that he could get to you even in here. Yeah, but he can't. He's just saying that to mess with your mind. And how do you know? How do you know that he's not using Jen so she can, she can try to hurt you? He can't. I know Jen. And she would never do anything to hurt me. Well, I would like to know what he meant then. Allison Perkins. What are you doing here? 